Hi folks, just a really quick video today talking about how to get onto the Xbox Insider program. Now, it used to be that in order to get onto the Xbox Insider program, you had to have somebody who was already on the program send a request for you. And then Microsoft would get back to you and you would respond to their message. And then within, I think, 24 or 48 hours, you'd be on the program. And then once you were on the program, you'd have the hub and you'd go into that and then you could set it up from there. However, it's a bit different to that now. And in order to get onto it now, you just need to download the Xbox Insider Hub. And you do that by going into the store. So let's do that now. If I press the Xbox button and go down and into the store and then go to search. And then from search, you would type in Xbox. And then Insider, and I think I've just put the I and it should come up. There you go, Xbox Insider Hub. So you go to that. And then obviously I've already got the Xbox Insider Hub installed. So it's just giving me the option to launch. But for you, if you haven't downloaded it already, it will give you the option to download it. Now, it is a free app, doesn't cost any money. There's no hidden costs or anything. It's just straightforward. You just install it and go from there. And once you've installed it, you would load it up. So let's do that now. I'm not going to do it from here, though. I'm going to go back to the desktop first. And obviously, it will be in your games and apps under apps, under Xbox Insider Hub. But I've got it there, so let's go into it from here. So if I press A to load it up, and this is what I see when I go into the app. Now, it will change a little bit as things change within the program. But this is basically what you'll see every time. However, the very first time you load it up, it will look a little bit different because there is one more thing you have to do first. And if you look on the far left hand side here under where it says Xbox Insider, when you first load it up, it will give you the option to join. And there will be a little checkbox that you press, a button that you press. You press on that, or click on that by pressing A, and it will set the process in motion of you joining. And then I'm not sure how long it takes because I've been in the program quite a long time now. As you can see, I've been in there over two years. But I think it's about 24, 48 hours and you'll be signed up to the program. When you are signed up to the program, though, you won't be on the same tier that I'm on currently. And I'm on the highest tier. And if you look over here, it says this console is in preview alpha. And that's the highest tier. That means I get the sort of earliest beaters, if you like, of the software that they're releasing. But there are levels of this. And if I click on this now, and if you look over here on the right, it's got Manage. If I press on Manage, you can see here the levels. Now, obviously, unenroll, I can unenroll from the program. The first level is Preview Omega. And if you see what it says there, it says preview Omega users receive the fewest system updates. Users may receive system updates which are almost ready for public release or new version of the publicly released build incorporating new fixes. So you get a few things earlier than the general releases. Then you've got preview Delta, which is at the next tier up, obviously. And in order to get onto Preview Delta, you do have to have been on the program for one plus months and have an insider level of two plus. And you get the levels by responding to questionnaires and stuff like that within the program. So the more active you are in the program, the higher up you can get. And if you look at the next level, we've got you have to have a tenure of three months and then insider level of four plus and you get more frequent updates. And then you get to Preview Alpha, which is where I am. And it says Preview Alpha is the cutting edge and users in this group receive access to new features and fixes as soon as possible at the expense of potential bugs. Now, that might sound scary, but as you can see, if we go back, I've been on the program for two years and five months, and I've never had anything significant. The worst thing really that's ever happened to me is <laughs> the, the font's been a bit mangled and I haven't been able to read stuff perfectly. But to be honest, you can usually work it out and it's only the odd letter that's mi mixed up. And that's about the worst that's ever happened to me. I know some people have had slightly more happen than that, 
But that's about it. And it's not really... They're, they're not going to put stuff out there that's going to brick your console. Not in general, anyway, unless they've made a real cock up. But that's it, basically. You go in, and once you're in, you can answer polls. You can rate content. If we go in, if I do rate content, these ones I've done. And if you see, look, there's little stars on there. If I go down, I can change these. And every time you answer one of these, and obviously if I do it again, it's not going to give me any XP. But every time you answer one of these, you get XP. And every time you get XP, if you look at the little circle here with 1400 in it, my next level will be 1480. And each time you go up, it takes you to the next level. And if you're active in the program, that keeps you in the top level, in the top, in the preview alpha. As I say, you can drop yourself down if you want to. If we go back in here again, as I say, I could actually go across and I could choose to be in a lower level. But I like to be at the top level specifically because I'm, well, making videos like this one. And the higher up I am, the sooner I get downloads. And I think the uh, fall update, I got back in the summer. So I had it long before a lot of other people. And that's because I'm very active on this and I'm always answering the questionnaires and stuff. And, you know, it's it's quite good fun. If we go down here, you can see all the other people who are on the program that I know that are on my friends list. And uh, <laughs> I'm the top of my friends list. I'm even higher than Major Nelson <laughs> and Phil Spencer. But I'm pretty so sure they've seen all this stuff long before I ever get to see it. But anyway, that's just a bit of fun. Um, but that's it, basically. In order to get on it, you just download the app, go into the app for the first time, and on the left-hand side, click Join. Once you've joined, you wait until you're joined up, and then just become active in the program. And then you'll go up the levels until you end up at Preview Alpha, if you want to be. But that's basically it, really. There's nothing more to say. I'm going to go and grab myself a cup of tea, because I've been trying to do this video for a while now, and my voice keeps cracking. So, uh, yeah, I'm going to grab a cup of tea, and I'll speak to you in the next one. Bye.